Hi, Joel Grimes here with the 59 inch deep parabolic Zeppelin. As a general rule, when we talk about beauty fashion, one of the, I think, the most beautiful ways to approach it is to put a modifier straight over the camera. And what that does is that gives you a, if you haven't the right height, you have a shadow slightly under the eye, or the eyebrow, the nose, the lip, and the chin. So I adjust the height of my overhead light by how much shadow I want. And with the 59 inch Zeppelin, I have a number of options that I can do that with. But what I've been doing is I've been putting just the inner baffle in. And what that does is it softens the light, but also because there's about a four inch gap between the baffle and the silver interior, we get a little bit of light blowing around and it kind of gives a little bit of a punch edge to the whole thing. So it's kind of like in between a soft and a really harsh look. And at 10 feet, I think it's kind of what I find is the sweet spot. And again, depending on how far you put that from your subject, the bigger the source in relationship to your subject, the softer the light. So right now, I've got this set up at about 10 to 12 feet, which I, have, I think is a really good sort of like sweet spot for it. What we're gonna do is also, we have Allie, our beautiful model, and we're gonna have her against the white wall leaning. I love that sort of push, pushing someone up against the white wall where they can push their body and lean and relax. Uh, when on a white sweep, it's hard to do that. Uh, but anyways, we're going to do that. And that also gives me some bounce back light as a fill sort of coming back from the backside, which also softens the overall look. So we're going to use a 70 to 200 lens, which also I can compact a little bit. Uh, normally I shoot kind of wide, but this is a great, because this, the Zeppelin is so big, I can get back and then use that longer lens, compact my uh, focal length, and we're gonna do some headshots and also some sort of waist up. Well, that was a lot of fun. Thank you, Allie. I think once we added that fan, it really sort of gave a little bit of life and a little bit of movement to the whole thing. So that's the fun thing about uh, creating, is just letting it happen, and again, having a beautiful model helps. So my encouragement to you is to go out, goof around, have fun, and create.